two companies just announced uh, glasses that you put on that have very small monitors. Uh, ODG is one of them. You're looking through two 720p or two 1080p video monitors they just showed this morning. And you're seeing through these monitors into the real world. Now they're uh, dorky and large and expensive right now. But if you look 10 years from now, we're all gonna have a little thing on our face that uh, tells us stuff about the world, lets us play chess on this table, and lets me say, hey, can you send a message to Andrew Keen, right? So we're not gonna be carrying these kind of devices around? We might have them in our pocket, but we're gonna look at them a lot less. Where are we in this whole artificial intelligence, robotic innovation adaption curve? There's a new company called Viv.ai that's gonna come out in the next six months. Um, Viv, uh, first of all, is open on the bottom. So Foursquare can, can say, hey, I'm an API, and if you hear the word Foursquare, just give us that data, and we'll take care of it. So it's going to be an exponential learner. It's not hard-coded at the bottom. Viv also, when you search, it writes the 80 lines of code as you search. So in 1 20th of a second, it writes the 80 lines of code for you. And it's very, very flexible, and it can do longer statements and multi, multiple uh, uh, statements, so you can stick m more things onto the, to the query that you're going to give it. And it also uh, remembers everything you tell it in a profile, which brings up a whole new argument about uh, privacy. Uh, if you say to Viv, hey, can you deliver me a, a, a large pepperoni pizza from Roundtable, it's going to stick in the, the profile, and, and you can see the profile, by the way, and look at it and correct it if it gets it wrong. You can see that you told it a, something about round table pizza, and that you like l large pizzas, and that you like pepperoni pizzas. So the next time you say, hey, can you deliver a pizza, it'll just say, hey, would you like the round table pizza, a large round table pepperoni pizza? Um, do you have any thoughts or predictions on the Microsoft HoloLens and that type of AR technology? What is that? I don't even know. HoloLens, so I was talking about ODG earlier uh, that just announced new glasses. ODG, uh, Ralph Osterhout, who started ODG, has been building these things for the military for 10 years, uh, right across the street from the ballpark in San Francisco. And he, he uh, bundled his first 40 patents up and sold them to Microsoft, and that became HoloLens. And HoloLens is a thing you wear with two 720p screens, and you see through it, and it augments, and it, it could put Minecraft here. It also has a 3D sensor on it, so it builds a, a map of what it's looking at, right? That sensor, by the way, is, I, I, I predict is going to go away quickly. In the next 18 months, you're going to go to two little cameras that are going to map out this world. Uh, uh, Stereolabs.com already is showing uh, how you do it with two cameras and build a 3D map of the world as you will look around. They say it's just, uh, they need Moore's Law to flip a couple more times. So three more years. And Qualcomm is announcing new chips this year, this week for drones to do the two camera idea. So drones can look at um, the world and map it out in 3D and then fly through the trees. Virtual reality, Robert. Yeah. For real? Or is this? The ultimate fact. I, I went to 20th Century Fox uh, and talked to Ted Shilowitz, the futurist there, and uh, he showed me new movies, he showed me new video games. Uh, he said entertainment's just about to really change in the next few years because we're going to be able to experience uh, movies. And movies are not going to be the same, right? When we, we made a movie, on film, it had to run from beginning to end, and we had to watch it from beginning to end. VR movies maybe are going to change if I look over here, right? And then all of a sudden something is going to happen over here because I looked over here. And the, the sensors in the, in the VR know that I looked over there and can change the content. So we're going to see new kind of movie that we haven't really explored how this is going to happen yet.